The mystery of light has puzzled people since ancient times. Ancient Greek scholars like Euclid and Ptolemy believed that rays shot out from our eyes, allowing us to see objects. Aristotle believed the sun was the sole source of light, and that light traveled as a wave through a medium. Debates over the true nature of light continued into the 17th century, and then came one scientist changed everything, Isaac Newton. Using a prism, Newton discovered that white light is made up of multiple monochromatic lights. He argued these were made of tiny particles, but Newton's particle theory couldn't explain everything about light, because light also flows like a wave. About 180 years later, Thomas Young conducted an experiment with light, the famous double-slit experiment. If light were made of particles, it would leave two distinct lines on the screen behind, but instead of two lines, multiple lines appeared on the screen. This could only happen if light wasn't a particle, but a wave. In the mid-19th century, James Clerk Maxwell realized through his namesake Maxwell's equations that light is a type of electromagnetic wave generated by electric and magnetic fields. Electric field and magnetic field oriented perpendicular to each other. An oscillating electric field causes a magnetic field to oscillate, and the oscillating magnetic field causes the electric field to oscillate again. Like a dance, these rippling fields generate each other in a chain reaction, propagating through space as electromagnetic waves, what we call light. Some scientists even called Maxwell's equations a blueprint from the hand of God. Just as the wave theory was becoming firmly established, a new shift emerged. Albert Einstein, 